great news for the world of horror or if you're a fan of the Scream franchise. After playing coy on the idea of returning for quite some time now, it has officially been confirmed that lead actress Nev Campbell will be back as survivor Sidney Prescott for Scream 5. So, we now have the original trio coming back, which continues on the tradition of this core group right here, really being the soul of the franchise. While we do have some other casting already occurring to fill out the other rows of Woodsboro and the newer cast, this is the announcement that we have been waiting for. This is also good as Nev has also stated a while back that while she loved the work done by the new directors, Radio Silence, she would only come back if the script was both complete instead of receiving new pages on the daily and that the script was good enough to honor the late Wes Craven's legacy and to his previous four films of the franchise. This film will also be the first to be produced by Paramount, and if anything is to go on based on previous comments, success from this one could lead to this launching a new trilogy. Wes Craven said they were going to do the fifth and the sixth one back to back, should they have been greenlit, so I'm wondering if those plans will remain the same, should this film be successful. I am so excited for it, but I also hope that the rumors of a new trilogy doesn't mean that they're going to kill off the legacy characters just to prop up the new characters into the spotlight. That would, I think, sit not only bad with me, but many fans who really love these characters and their evolution throughout the films. But with casting seeming to round itself out with some new and up coming actors, such as Jack Quaid from The Boys, which actually does kind of make me excited because it's a really diverse cast, I know that I can't be the only one hoping for Kirby, aka Hayden Pinatier, to make a return at some point into this universe. I think I personally would love to see that, and Wes Craven intended on cutting her scene with her moving, her death scene supposedly, on case he wanted to bring her back, and I think bringing her back would actually be a really good idea to have a new Randy who feels like, you know, it feels like Kirby, it's her own character. But also, given that every murder spree by the iconic Ghostface has some ties to Sydney overall, I'm curious if they will change this up to make her more of the mentor figure instead of the central motivator to Ghostface's motives. But we shall see. Production for this film is supposedly set to start later this year with a release date of January 14th, 2022, after being pushed back due to the pandemic. But I am so, so excited for this film, and I can't wait to continue to follow all the details of this new Scream film. And I really hope that Scream can continue to live because it's one of the few horror films out there where every film has been good to great, barring some personal taste for the third film. But almost every film has been really good, and it's hard for a horror franchise to keep that consistency. But let me know your excitement level for Sydney returning to the franchise, and how big of a role are you hoping that she gets? Also, are, do you, are you okay with her potentially dying in this film, or do you want to see her continue on? Let me know down below.